Space is an increasingly mysterious realm. Astronomers have busied themselves in looking for an elusive planet 9, which is believed to be positioned at the edge of the solar system. This mysterious planet has sparked a lot of speculation in the space community. But why? After all, what is so fascinating about Planet Nine? If Planet Nine really exists, there is a possibility of the presence of a deep, dark world in sight. While some argue that this suspected entity is nothing of consequence except for a grapefruit-sized black hole, others believe that it is something grander than just being a mere black hole. In today's exciting video, we will share with you the captivating tale of the existence of this hypothetical object located in the elliptical orbit far beyond Pluto. Before we begin, make sure you have pressed the like button and tap the subscribe button to keep yourself updated about the latest space, NASA, and JWST news. So let's dive into the details and solve the dark mystery behind the existence of Planet Nine. It has been decades since astronomers started researching the solar system, area that lies beyond the orbit of Neptune. And then, when Pluto was discovered by mere luck in 1930, astronomers understood that there is no definite norm that governs the exact number of planets in our solar system. The number of planets in our solar system may increase. After all, it won't be anything unusual. The space world is all about endless discoveries and revelations. Probably that's the reason why astronomers have concentrated on investigating the presence of a bizarre, massive object that is located in an extremely elongated orbit in the outer solar system. It is believed that this frozen planet is enveloped by the remnants of the icy cometary bodies of the Kuiper Belt. The farthest end of this solar system is stuffed with plenty of extreme trans-Neptunian objects, or ETNOs. It was in 2003 when the most startling discovery occurred. The weirdest ETNO called Sedna was discovered by astronomers. Won't you be shocked to know that the Sedna is nothing sort of a black hole or a mere space entity? Rather, it is quite large and massive. You can even term it giant-like. But yes, it is half the size of Pluto. Anyway, the climactic point is that astronomers are scratching their heads hard because it is indeed a mystery to decode how such a planet-sized object in space made its way to such a remote orbit without getting expelled out of the solar system. That's not the end of baffling inventions. Astronomers have come to observe some other ETNOs as well. About six more objects with identical orbits having the same degree of ellipticity were found in this area. How come these orbits are present here? After all, this is an unusual situation. Though astronomers came up with the view that a mysterious planet 9 seems to exist in the solar system, and that this new planet is probably responsible for shaping and organizing them in their orbits. Nothing conclusive came out of this relentless quest for Planet Nine. It's hard to spot it because the space researchers don't even have a clear picture of this mysterious object. Anyway, the search for Planet Nine continues. Just like its close neighbors of Uranus and Neptune, Planet Nine is expected to be gaseous. There is only an artistic rendering that shows the faraway view from Planet Nine back towards the sun. Astronomers are more or less certain of the fact that this gigantic planet does exist, but if you ask for evidence of the same, well, it will then be hard to offer. This so-called new planet of our solar system has a mass that is almost 10 times more than that of Earth. It is so huge that its girth even reaches the area of one of the ice giants, which in turn, is the nickname given to the two isolated planets of Uranus and Neptune. Space researchers are heavily puzzled as to how this enigmatic planet has come into being. It could be possible that this unknown new planet was situated in some area between the orbits of Jupiter to Neptune. Before it could gain the ability to settle itself comfortably in space, it must have received a strong kick or push from the gravitational force of any one gas giant. This might have cornered Planet Nine and made it situate itself in an area where nothing can be found except for icy wastes. Some astronomers are also of the opinion that Planet Nine could have been a kidnapped child, 
as it is now lying in an unknown area after being taken away from a passing star, perhaps. A long time ago, in the past. Astronomers have to find answers to several puzzling questions. But before seeing how they succeed in doing that, let's unravel the big twist lying ahead in this tale of Planet Nine. No astronomer has succeeded yet in getting the chance to observe this peculiar planet-like object directly. Two renowned space researchers named Konstantin Betagin and Mike Brown have worked hard to trace the existence of this mystifying planet. Through mathematical modeling and computer simulations, the duo came up with interesting info about the existence of Planet Nine. According to Brown, the size of this bizarre planet is enough to testify to the fact that it is a true planet. There is no iota of doubt about that. So, there is no chance of it being a dwarf planet. In fact, Planet Nine is conjectured to be dominating the solar system's neighborhood. It has a mass 5,000 times that of Pluto. So, there is no doubt that it is nothing but a planet. As Brown went on to remark, this would be a real ninth planet. There have only been two true planets discovered since ancient times, and this would be a third. It's a pretty substantial chunk of our solar system that's still out there to be found, which is pretty exciting. The simulations helped in unraveling the fact that there would be objects in the Kuiper belt, in orbits that are inclined to the plane of the planets perpendicularly. Betagen got immersed in accumulating evidence for these objects in his simulations. Along with Brown, Betagen came up with something very, very interesting. In the past three years, space observers have noted the presence of four objects that have been tracing orbits in the way that we have discussed just now. That is, at a right angle or perpendicularly from Neptune and another object. The simulations matched, and voila, the presence of Sedna was discovered. It is an age-old belief that the solar system began with only four planetary cores that engulfed the gas surrounding them. This resulted in the emergence of four gas planets that include Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Later, as an outcome of several collisions and ejections, the planets shifted to the locations at which they are currently based. Brown suggests the possible existence of the fifth core in the past. And guess what the interesting fact is? This very elusive Planet Nine could be the fifth core. Planet Nine got too close to Jupiter or Saturn, and as a consequence of strong gravitational pull, it could have drifted away to a distant orbit far beyond Pluto. Though the presence of Planet Nine in space is confirmed, it is not known where exactly it is located on the distant elliptical path. There are two possibilities by which the planet's exact location can be discovered. One, if the planet is located close to the perihelion, previous and current space surveys that are being done now can help in unearthing a lot about its presence in the system. Second, if Planet Nine is located at a faraway point in its orbit, several large telescopes, such as the Subaru Telescope and the twin 10-meter telescopes at the W.M. Keck Observatory, can spot this queer planet easily. The presence of Planet Nine has triggered the discussion of it being a primordial black hole. Though another group of astronomers believe that the trans-Neptunian object, Anomaly, exists for sure, they are not sure if Planet Nine is hiding somewhere between the T and O. The planet hunting activity has been going on for some time now, but it is not known when we will be getting our hands on a clear picture that will showcase the correct location of this oddball. Astronomers would have to narrow down on specific sections of the skies where Planet Nine can exist. Only then, the telescopes can be employed to take pictures of this fascinating planet. Of course, it won't be possible for the telescopes to go about taking pictures by moving around the vast, endless expanse of the sky. Let's wait and see if the astronomers succeed in ascertaining the exact area where this new ninth planet of our solar system may exist. But for now, our solar system continues to thrive as an eight-planet family. Keep your excitement high, because we can get our hands on a brand new picture of Planet Nine anytime in the coming years. How excited are you to rest your eyes on the mysterious Planet Nine? Let us know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed watching the video, do press the like button and tap the subscribe button as well to keep receiving space and NASA news. JWST and various other observatory updates. See you in our next video.